AI is truly a game changer for video editors. With just a few clicks, you can easily remove any object from a video. Because Flamora makes it super easy for us. You can even add logos, videos, or animation effortlessly without needing advanced settings by using the planar tracker feature in Flamora. Let's discover just how simple it is to do it in Undershare Flamora. In this amazing software of Flimora, we have a video of a man wearing a t-shirt with a logo on it. Now it's time to remove the logo from the video. First ensure the video is selected, then head over to the video settings. All the AI feature can be found in the AI tools section, including chroma key, AI portrait cutout, smart cutout, and finally the AI object remover. I gradually cover all the new features of Flimora. For now, let's export the AI object remover. Just click on the click to remove object icon to open the pop-up window for this feature. When you hover your mouse point over the video, it transforms into a brush that you can use to mask the area you want to remove. You can easily adjust the brush size by sliding its slider. Removing the object is simple. For this video, just select the area of the logo and once that is done, hit the remove button. Filmora's AI will analyze the video, generate a duplicate and seamlessly remove the selected object, giving you an awesome footage. Now let's play back the video to see the result of the Filmora, how perfect it is after removing the logo from the t-shirt. Thanks Filmora for making this impossible work easy for us. Undershare Filmora is an easy to use video editing software for both beginners and advanced users. It's available on Windows, Mac and mobile. Its pre-made transitions and effects make your video editing more interesting without need to purchase additional expensive plugins. The advanced AI portrait cutout feature allows you to remove the background from any video without a green screen. With features like text to speech, AI music and AI sound effects, it truly functions like an all-in-on video editing software. For more details, check out the video description below. The next step is planar tracking. To access it, go to the AI tab and scroll down to planar tracking option. If you notice that the planar tracker option is disabled, simply click to enable it. Planar tracking offers two modes, auto and advanced. Both are so intuitive that a beginner could use them with ease. If you choose the advanced option, a rectangle will instantly appear in the player monitor. From here, we need to do a few simple steps. Place the rectangle in the desired position you want to track. Adjust its points if needed and select the tracking accuracy, low, default or high. Finally, hit the track forward or track backward to complete the tracking process. If needed, you can delete the tracking by clicking the delete button. The automate is even easier and delivers good results for this footage. Let's see how it works. Simply click on auto, then position the planar tracker where you want to track, such as on the t-shirt, and adjust the tracking points as needed. By the way, the planar tracker is perfect for tracking flat surfaces. Power mesh tracking may be added in the future. Once ready, hit the start button to allow Flimora to track the footage. Within a moment, the tracking process will be complete. The results are impressive rivaling those of professional planet tracker software like Mockup Pro. Adding text or animation is the final step of this tutorial. Start by clicking on the text tab and selecting quick text. This will add a text layer to the timeline. Adjust the text duration to match the underlying video layer. To edit text, double click on the text in the player monitor. Next, go to the text settings options and replace the current text with your desired content, such as music or anything else you prefer. Choose a font that complements your footage. Handwritten forms often work well for music titles. You can also make other adjustments such as changing the font color and applying the animation to the text. To reset the text, simply grab and drag the text selection points. Once your text is ready, it's time to attach it to the planet tracker area. This process is straightforward. Select the tracking video layer, head over to the tracking options and click the drop down menu for link element. You can link a logo or footage from your local drive by selecting the input from computer option. Since we already have a text on the timeline, choose basic on to link the text to the tracking area. And just like that, boom, the text is now attached to the tracking area. To see how it works, move the time indicator and play the video. Keep in mind that everything linked to the planner tracker will appear inside the tracking area. If the text is too large or too small, adjust its size accordingly. To hide the tracker, simply click the eye icon to turn it off. Play the video again to review the final result. 
The video looks great but the text is not blending perfectly with the t-shirt. Let's make some adjustments to improve it. First highlight the text layer and click on advanced in the text settings. A new window will appear. If you can see the text or video, adjust the position of the time indicator until it becomes visible. Now fine tune the text by adjusting the blur slider, move it to the left or right to achieve the desired effect. You can also slightly decrease the opacity to make the text blend better with the t-shirt. Once you have made the adjustments, hit the apply to confirm the new settings. And that's it. Removing objects and adding text has been completed quickly and easily using the powerful AI features of Undershare Flimora. With this method, you can seamlessly add almost anything anywhere, whether it's on a wall, car, or billboard. Check out the video description for more details about Flimora. Thanks for watching this tutorial and I hope to see you in the next video.